Another thing I like to do right after installing Active Directory is enabling the Active Directory Recycle Bin. Now, I'm not sure why Microsoft has not seen fit to make this a default option, the way a Recycle Bin for the File Manager is a default option, right? You delete a file, you can go in there, you can recover the file just in case you deleted it accidentally. Well, re um, Active Directory has something similar. It has a recycle bin, but Microsoft doesn't turn it on by default. We have to manually enable it. So here's how you do that. Go to Tools, and in here are all of the Active Directory management tools, and the one we want for this is the Active Directory Administrative Center. So I'm going to click on the ADAC, and then right-click on the domain that you want to enable the recycle bin for. So I'm going to right-click here and just click Enable Recycle Bin. It says, are you sure you want to perform this action? Once it's done, it cannot be undone. You click OK, and it says ADDS has begun enabling the recycle bin. Click OK, and that's it. That's all we have to do to enable the Active Directory Recycle Bin. Now, any time that something gets deleted and we need to bring it back, we can find the recycle bin and locate things. In fact, let me close out of ADAC here real quick. And I'm going to go to, not manage, tools, open it back up. And here's my um, domain. And as I go through the domain, I have this lost and found. I have uh, right here. This is the one that I want, deleted objects. This is my recycle bin. So anything that I delete now comes into my deleted objects folder, and then I can go restore it if I need to. So that is your Active Directory recycle bin, something that I think is incredibly useful because let's face it, mistakes happen, right? We misread something, we delete the wrong account, we delete the wrong group, we click on the wrong thing by accident, it happens. And this gives us a rapid way to recover anything that accidentally gets deleted in Active Directory.